We are in it. In it to win it, I guess you guys would say. We're back on that 30-day blitz. It is, uh, man, I tried to talk to you guys earlier about changes and being on such a calorie surplus and putting on that muscle and then going into a good deficit and program that's set up to win. Man, the changes are quick, obviously. Uh, you guys can see it now. So a whole bunch of stuff I want to go over today. It's going to be no edited, just right up YouTube video talking about everything I talked about on Generation Iron summed up real simply. And then everything I talked about was last week training with Billy Gunn. Real simple. Real simple. Weightlifting is beneficial if done right. Now, what is right? Well, full range of motion, working with weights that stress the body, but don't possibly put you in a danger zone. And that's something for you guys to decide on how much that weight is, but keep the range of motion the best you possibly can. Rep range, again, a good rep range, three to eight. Um, in control, why not 10 to 12? Just overkill. Again, you're going to a level where it's gonna fatigue you before you get to the second exercise. And I want the, butt, the muscle, whichever you're training, hit from different angles. So that's another key important, important part. Do you need to go to fatigue? No. Do you need to superset through it? Depending on where you are, are you putting on size? Are you cutting up? That's where I would really use those things. But would I do it all the time? No. Would I train to fatigue? Not even dieting would I train to fatigue. Um, I would train to where I stimulate and tear the fibers of the muscles and then get out, recover. I was going over something and I was thinking back to a couple guys that said, hey, I'm gonna squat for the next 30 days every day. Cool, it's fun, it's really fun and it keeps you motivated, that's great. Is it smart? Not in my book. Try to find something else that's more beneficial. Um, can you do it and build muscle? Well, sure, you can shock the body to make it grow. I've always believed that, and I told you about that with my arms when I was a, a young teenage power lifter. But at the end of the day, can you recover? Can you recover? with the food that you're eating, the sleep that you're getting, the stress that's in your life, can you recover? And I'm talking about not just the food, the sleep, whatever you're doing with your job, but the emotional recovery as well to go back in the next day and then again the next day. So be smart, guys. Um, this page is solely about trying to make all of you better than what I became and trying to give you all that information. And that's the same thing Robbie Robinson is doing, that's the same thing Billy Gunn is doing. Those people that I bring in to train with us usually are high quality people that have learned something or willing to learn something. Are you willing to learn something? Then you're finding, you found the right page to learn. Um, if you close down and your cup is too full, move on, move on to the next page, whatever stimulates you emotionally, physically, mentally, hormonally, you know, do your thing, man. In my case, I'm loving this, and I'm loving this next stage that we're doing. Stay with me, because the blitz is kicking into gear. We start July 1st, this new movie. Watch this transformation. Take care.